justice has been served, yet nothing will bring back the two lives lost as the parents and families of Lana Kalista Samuelu and Lame Kosiu were in court today to witness as the acting Chief Justice Bui Clarence Nelson passed down the prison sentencing of the two senior nurses who each pleaded guilty to the manslaughter of the one-year-old babies. It has been over one year since the death of Lana Kalista and Lameko, who died at Safoto Hospital in Savai'i, minutes after receiving what telephone can now reveal to be the MMR vaccine that was wrongly mixed by one of the two nurses. It took almost two hours for the acting chief justice to pass down his decision, stating that the two babies died from the actions of the two senior nurses. In his decision, Lucy M. Otavale mixed the MMR vaccine with the atracurium, a medication used in addition to other medications to provide skeletal muscles relaxation during surgery or mechanical ventilation instead of the dilute vaccine. Tawale wrongly mixed the two vaccines, an action the judge called a deadly mix. For Lana Kalista Samuelu, the vaccine was administered by the trainee nurse. He also added that the tragic incident could have been avoided if the two nurses used common sense and followed the administration's of vaccines protocols. But Le Emoteo went ahead and administered the vaccine to the second victim without taking into account that a baby girl had just died soon after her vaccination. The two nurses have breached their work by failing to follow the procedures of double-checking the vaccines. After the second victim died, Lusa went to the rubbish and checked the vaccine bottle and found out it was the Adracurium, which she put in a plastic bag and took it home. Passing down his decision, acting Chief Justice Roy Clarence Nelson stressed that there is no question in his mind that an imprisonment sentence is required. He also stressed that defendants are accountable for the harm that they have caused, not only to the victims, whose lives were cut short, but also the harm to the families involved. Salvalia pleaded guilty to the two charges of manslaughter and one charge of attempting to obstruct and defeat the course of justice for the death of both Lana Kalista Samuelu and Lame Kusiu. She is sentenced to prison for five years and six months. Leotongi Teo has pleaded guilty to one charge of manslaughter. She has been sent to prison for five years. Parents of both babies broke down in tears and told Salafo that they accept the court's decision and have forgiven the two nurses, but nothing would bring the alarmed one back. Bui also stated that the accused were senior registered nurses in Samoa and had worked over for 30 years. The beloved Lana Kalista Samuelu and Lame Kusiu died on the 6th of July last year. Both children had only just celebrated their first birthday. Jack Semanudafa for Talafo.